Isaiah, and then our movie was The Notebook. Okay. So, hold up. Oh, yes, that Okay. Yeah, uh, we'll begin. What book are you going to read for me today? It's a love story. Oh, <laughs> uh, what love story? This is a, um, about Nosea and Alma. That's my favorite. Yeah. <laughs> Good, now let's begin. This is how the love story of Nosea and Alma began. The Lord told Nosea to take Alma, an adulterous woman, as his wife, so that Nosea may feel the same love he received from us.
Okay. Dear Almer, I love you and I miss you so much. I know that you have been selling yourself, but nonetheless, know that my love for you is still the same and I'll chase your heart and affections until my life may pass. Love, Nosea. <laughs> oh my, what have I done? I just pulled my body to the man. What? 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 What?
Girls, can you move? I gotta get through here. Hey, hey, don't bother the judges. Take off your shoes, for this is a holy ground, and bow down before me, for I am your God. <laughs> Bohan, I am God of your father, God of Fazu, God of Fawu, and God of Famu. I have seen the pain of my people, the Israelites, because of the Hunjiptians. I will help you defeat the Egyptians and take you out of that wretched land. You will speak to the Pharaoh and he will let you go. But, but I can't do it. I'm not a good speaker. Who has made man's mouth? Who makes him mute or deaf or seeing or blind? Is it not I, the Lord? So now go. Even if I could speak to Pharaoh, my dad wouldn't let me do it. I will change and transform your father's heart to do my will. But I'm a woman. <laughs> Stop, Mulan. I will surely be with you, high and low, day and night, nonetheless. Okay, I will do as you say. Frogs. 
time flies. Live socks. Boils. What is that? Tails. Darkness. Firstborn. Thank you. 
So, uh, we had uh, Isaiah and Nacho Libre, and uh, the thing is, Isaiah doesn't really have a definite story, um, one that people know well, so we kind of made, a, made up a story, like as if God gave him a prophecy for him to live out. Oh, no. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Isaiah, Isaiah. God? Oh, oh, uh, Father, Father, <coughs> what must I do for you? There's something you must do in the certain future. There is an evil man named Neb who controls the baby loan company. Okay, what must I do? There will be a man, his name is Luce Nacho. <laughs> you must guide him and help him defeat the company. Okay, Lord. Daddy, I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> A few years later. <laughs> All right, you guys know about the corn, right? When you eat Wait, corn. Who are you? I am, by the way, I am Pastor June. Oh. And you guys all know about corn, right? When you eat corn, it's obvious when you eat corn. Oh, hey there. Uh. This is my big daughter. <laughs> <laughs> come here, come here, come here. Come here. Yeah, she's shy. <laughs> Anyways, about the corn again. It's obvious when you eat the corn. What are you doing? What is this? That's what I want to be when I grow up. A Mexican wrestler? <gasps> yeah. No, you can't be. They're violent, they're selfish, they're violent, and they're only about the money. You can't be a Mexican wrestler. <clears throat> Alright, few few more years into the future. <laughs> Everyone, 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 there is an epic wrestling contest. Competition? <laughs> no. This night, the winner gets five grand. But, wait, did you really have to say everyone three times in a row? Oh, yes. Because if I say three more times, then it's way more powerful. <laughs> Because even though he lost, he still earned some money, and it was a lot more money than he was earning in any other profession. So he got beat down, and he lost, and he lost, and he lost. But there was this one match, but he lost that one too. Not really relevant. But anyway, one day he uh, he meets with Neb, the owner of or the CEO of the baby lawn company. Hey, Nacho. I saw your play. Um, excuse me, who are you? Um, Ned. Ned. <laughs> and CEO of Baby Loan Company, wrestling company. Oh, wow, Mr. Ned, I am so, so honored to meet you. So, what do you want? <laughs> uh, <laughs> I want to hire. 
Am I going to make money? Yeah. Money yeah, phone? Yeah, phone. Phone. Wait, what is that? This is condimental and this is the black mamba. Well, I would love to work there. Thank you so much. I'll see you tomorrow then. Okay. Anyway, is your name Nacho Libre? Um, yeah, who are you? I've been looking everywhere for you. I'm Isaiah. God sent me to find you so you could take down the Babylon Company. Uh, they, Babylon Wrestling Company? They just offered me a job. You know oh. how much better my life could get? Do you, was it Nev? Did you meet Nev? Uh, yeah, he's like the most no, famous you, person. No, you can't listen to him. He's all about himself. He only cares about money. He probably lied to you. Oh, you're just crazy, old man. Okay, okay, fine. Then let me be your partner. Like, in the wrestling match? Well, with your amazing talent and great strength that you just got yourself a job with, I wouldn't need to jump in now, would I? That's right. Got you. Okay. Alright. <laughs> <laughs> so, it's my first day at work as a professional wrestler. What do you want me to do? Um... You didn't forget, right? No, you have to go to... Oh no, you have to get the... Ch oh. <laughs> no, not the chicken. Eagle <laughs> <laughs> leg and a chicken coop? And you have to drink it, and you'll become strong. Okay. Wait, wait, wait what, what did he tell you? He told me I have to find an eagle leg and a chicken coop. That, that's crazy. What, what else did he tell you to do? What? I don't know. Oh, an eagle egg in a chicken coop. How convenient. Oh my god. Okay. okay um, I think we should think about this. Like, is it logical for an eagle egg to be in a... Did, did you just... That, that, that's nasty. Don't worry. That, I have work. You know... Oh yeah, this reminds me of poem. Okay. I ate some bugs. I ate some grass. I used my hand to wipe my... <laughs> that, that's a great poem, but um, I, it reminded me of a story that I heard once. Uh, there was an eagle, and he was in the midst of all these chicken, and he grew up thinking he was a chicken, and uh, you don't really care about the story, now, do you? What? I think. But, but, let's just go. Eagle power! Okay, so um, I think we should think about this. Do you, do you notice that um, you've got into the semifinals, yet you haven't won a single match in your life? It's because they're scared of me. Uh, Look at me! <laughs> I, uh, I, I, I feel like you should think this through. Maybe uh, Neb is kind of... No, Neb, Neb has done so much more for me than you ever did. All you did was tell me some random god bull stuff. <clears throat> All right, this is the semifinals. All right, wrestler to my left. He is the black, the <laughs> crazy, the strong, black bomba. We're left there, we're left there, huh? <laughs> right, to my right, we got the one foot, 60 pounded, Nacho Libre. Are you ready? Yeah. Are you ready? Oh, yeah. Fight. It's about not glorifying yourself, but glorifying God. You, you don't understand. God, God says that in your time of desperateness, in your weakest times, that He will come to you. Oh, no, I'm so hungry. <laughs> corn, 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 corn. One dollar? One dollar? Yeah, one dollar. Okay. 
Oh, corn. I remember another story that this guy told me. Um, the corn, it like, you, you like eat it, and then you like poop or something, and then like you see the corn, and like, well, it doesn't really matter, because like you shouldn't really be eating corn anyway, so like. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my heart! Are you okay? No! Did you not see the corn in my eye? You like that? Black just died. He's like a bomba. So you have to play the. Wait, he died? Yeah, he died. <laughs> <laughs>
One day, the Spartan Queen was giving birth to a baby. <laughs> and soon, the young boy was about seven years old. Oh, my beautiful son. <laughs> oh. My beautiful son. <laughs> Christian, he follows me, nonetheless. Oh, really? Can I test that out? Yeah, of course. All right, so I'm going to take everything around him away. Let's see if he still worships me. You can take anything you want, just don't hurt him physically. All right, let's see. <laughs> Sire, the Persians are coming. The Persians? All right, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, let's do some pre-war workout. Alright guys, follow me, okay? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> you guys think it's a joke? Easy! Right, guys, look up! Look up! Look up! Like a fresh! <laughs> Easy and breezy! <laughs> I think we're ready. Let's put on the armor of God! Let's 
left, 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 right, left, 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 right, left, 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 right, left, 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 left. Stop! My heart rate! Wake up! I have to go back home. <laughs> so after King Job lost his army, he was devastated. He asked God why he had forsaken him. So he went home to his wife to discuss it with her. Job, are you alright? I've been waiting for you. Faith, Faith. How's it going? My army's gone, but you're safe. Satan tingle. Yo, 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 no. Oh, oh, wait, no. God, first my army, not my wife. Why have you done this to me? See, Satan, I told you he wouldn't worship you. He doesn't like you. Look at that. Just keep watching. I doubt anything will change. Nonetheless, my father, I still love you because you are my God. See, I told you. Are you sure? Yeah. <laughs> now I'm going to give him back his army. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Oh, dude.